Hey guys, John Dean here, and in this video, we're going to actually publish our first article to our WordPress Direct blog. Uh, we're going to delve back into the published content module of Market Samurai, show you how to connect it to your WordPress Direct blog, and publish the draft article we've saved from a previous session. So let's head on inside Market Samurai and let's get to work. So here we are inside Market Samurai and in order to publish your um, article to your blog it's quite a straightforward process. Uh, you first of all need to come to the Publish Content module by clicking on Publish Content on the left hand side and then uh, what we're going to do is click on this View Local Drafts link. Now here you'll see I've got one uh, article that I've created already which is called On The Move and if we come over to the right hand side you'll see there's a pencil icon and that's the edit icon. If you click on that it will take you into the article and as you can see here's an article I've already written with uh, an image on the right hand side and some tags at the bottom and then all we need to do is click on this publish button. When you first click on publish you'll be asked to set up your WordPress direct account. Um, before, because obviously Market Samurai needs to access your WordPress direct account in order to pu publish to your blog. So the first thing you need to do is drop down this box here and you've got an option of creating a new WordPress blog account or a new WordPress direct account. You want to choose the second option which is new WordPress direct account. The first option, the new WordPress blog, is for self-hosted blogs that you've got on your own servers WordPress Direct is the service that we're actually using as part of the challenge. Um, so hopefully you've set up your WordPress Direct account and we need to click on this in order to access that account. So select the option for New WordPress Direct Account and then you'll be asked to put in an account name, a username and a password. Now the account name is purely for your reference when you open up Market Samurai and I'm just going to uh, call it My WPD ooh, Account. The username and password are the username and password you use to log into your WordPress Direct account which were, you chose at sign up. So I'm just going to put in my username and password. And then once I've done that I'm going to click on the add account button. Okay, once you've connected to your WordPress Direct account um, you need to choose from this drop down menu here the blog that you want to post to if you have more than one. So from that drop down box choose the site you want to publish to and then the next section is when you want to publish your article, your blog post. You can either choose to publish it immediately, you can choose to publish it on a certain date, you can choose to publish it X number of days after the last scheduled post or you can choose to publish it as draft which will save it um, as a draft version. I'm going to choose to publish it immediately by leaving this radio uh, button checked and then we can choose which category uh, to post it into. I'm just going to choose a category there and as I've got an image in my post we've actually got this option here saying where should images be placed. Now I'm going to choose upload images to the selected account because I want the image to be on the same server that my blog's on because it'll load nice and quickly. Um, and then we've got an option here which says after publishing track with Rank Tracker. Now we're going to cover Rank Tracker separately in a different video. So I'm going to leave that box unchecked for now. Um, so once I'm happy with all, all my information I'm just going to come down here and click publish new article. Market Samurai will then upload the images and it will make the post on the blog um, and after a few seconds you'll see it says post published click here to view it. So all you need to do is click on this on this link and it will open it um, in a browser and you'll see that the article has been published there with the text and the image um, and everything's in there that was in the original. So that's how easy it is to publish using the published content module. 